Hey, this is Spencer from AdventureSpencer.com. Uh, very, very uh, beaten and tired from an amazing night last night here in beautiful Charleston, South Carolina. And what I want to talk to you today about is going to particular cities and making sure to ask locals what is the premier destinations to go to. So typically what ends up happening uh, for myself as well as many other travelers is they'll get to a particular city and they'll either use Google, Yelp, or something equivalent that they'll use as their benchmark in order to uh, check out what venues, what destinations, and what type of things they want to do while they're spending that time in whatever city that they go to. And there really is a very powerful, extremely powerful thing that happens when you break away from that mold and simply go up to somebody and ask, what do I do? You know, if you have these types of questions, uh, just go up to a local and ask. You don't know what destination to go to? Ask a local. You don't know what venues to visit? Ask a local. Not sure where to eat? Ask a local. Everything really just boils down to ask a local. And in this internet savvy age, I mean, you can literally go to any country in the entire world and pretty much be completely fine. Uh, you have uh, Google, you have Yelp, you have all these different types of medias as well as social medias in order to get in contact with people. I mean, say if you're ever in a particular country and they don't even speak English per se, uh, you could honestly just contact people in that particular country that does speak English. So it's not to say that the internet doesn't give this amazing uh, type of opportunity no matter where you go, but at the exact same time, don't keep yourself so convoluted that you're not willing to go up to people that actually live in that city, that live and breathe it every single day, and just ask a simple question. Just be like, hey, what's the cool places to check out? Now, what I do wanna say as a quick note is to go and make sure that you're being very pointed and very specific in the questions that you're asking. And what exactly do I mean? All I want you to know and make sure to verify is that whenever you're going up to the people, make sure that they have actually been to these venues. Be like, hey, I wanna know what are the type of places that you go to all the time? Are these the type of venues that I should check out? And you're gonna want people with an emotional connection to these particular venues or destinations, places, whatnot. But the cool thing is, is that uh, many of the places that you'll go to, they might not even be talked about on Yelp or Google. A lot of, a lot of the places that I checked out yesterday. Let me just give you an example. Okay, so I got here in Charleston, South Carolina, and I busted out my Google, busted out my Yelp, and I was looking for a particular nightlife scene. And what ended up happening was I ended up looking at uh, this area called Market Street. Now, don't get me wrong, it was a Sunday, it was raining, but at the exact same time, everything was pointing to Market Street. Go to Market Street. Market Street is the place to go. And so I went to Market Street. And lo and behold, I went to all these venues where they had these amazing reviews. And the venues were nice, nothing against the venues, but there was no one there. You know, you had, you had couples, um, you had, you know, families eating together, you know, if you're looking for, uh, you know, to socialize and, and that type of stuff, um, it just wasn't ideal for that type of, uh, that type of atmosphere. So what did I do? All I simply did was I pivoted. I went up to uh, someone who was eating and uh, I said, "Hey, uh, quick question. Um, I'm not from here. I've been here for a few minutes, but I want to know the places that you really enjoy going to while you're here." And they looked at me point blank period and they said, King Street. And I was like, King Street. And uh, shout out to Sean if you're watching this video right now. But uh, uh, he said, King Street is king. And it was completely true. I simply did my pivot, walked down to King Street, and lo and behold, venues, people, uh, you know, you wanted it, they had it. So it was perfect. Um, just be willing to break out of that mold. Uh, you know, like I said before, the whole internet uh, age has given us this wealth of information, but at the exact same time, um, there's always that invisible wall 
uh, between the people that are actually in the city living there and the internet. You know, face-to-face -face communication beats out uh, the web just about any day of the week with a few exceptions. So this is Spencer from AdventureSpencer.com giving you common sense knowledge. Uh, I'm here in Charleston, South Carolina for a little bit more and I'll be on my way to Savannah, Georgia. Uh, thank you for watching. If you make it to the end, please make sure to subscribe and like. And I will see you guys next time. Stay frosty. Peace. What I want to talk to you today about is going... <laughs> fucking God. Fucking damn it! Oh! <laughs> hey, this is 